Hi there, this is Shep Hyken, customer service speaker, expert, and the author of the New York Times and Wall Street Journal best-selling business book, The Amazement Revolution. On this short video, I'm going to share a top 10 list of customer service strategies. I love how-to lists, and if you follow my work, some of these strategies may seem familiar, but I've added a few new ones. I took a look at some of my favorite articles and blog posts over the last year, and I chose 10 of the best strategies and lessons that I wrote about. So here they are. Number one, be better than average. Amazing companies don't always deliver wow or over the top type experiences. No, they're just a little better than average all of the time. And by the way, all of the time is a secret. Anyone can be good every once in a while, but it's the consistency that makes them amazing. Number two, pay attention to details. Sometimes it's the little things that make the biggest impact. Figure out what the details are that your customers most enjoy and make them a routine part of doing business with you. Number three, you may not be the owner, but you should care like you're the owner. Not all owners or executives are great leaders, but the ones that are should be emulated. Watch how they take pride in how they deal with their customers and employees. Then copy them. Act and care like you're the owner. Number four, Analyze when things go right. When a company receives a complaint, people usually have discussions to find out what went wrong and how to prevent it from happening again. Well, the next time you receive a letter of praise, meet the same way and find out what went right and how it can be repeated. Number five, focus on 100% wallet share. A loyal customer is a repeat customer, but may still buy from your competition. The ultimate loyal customer is a repeat customer that buys what you sell, but only from you and not from your competition. So what are you doing right now that is going to make sure that the customer, the next time they need what it is that you sell, will come back the next time, every time? Number six, use social media to enhance customer service by sending value-added messages, creating users groups, and monitoring what others are saying about you. Number seven, create a consistent experience. One sure way to erode loyalty is to deliver an inconsistent customer service experience. One time it's great, the next time it's barely average, and the next time it might be great again. Well, inconsistency creates uncertainty, and uncertainty erodes confidence. Lack of confidence leads to lack of trust. All of that leads to giving a customer a reason to consider doing business with your competition. Number eight, peopleize your business. I made that word up. People do business with people. Make it personal. Customers should want to do business with you because of you and your employees. Make your customers feel at home. You have a great location, cool displays, great signage, and all of that. Well, it's great, but if your people can't make your customers feel welcome and appreciated, all of that other stuff, it doesn't matter. Number nine, experience your own customer service. If possible, personally mystery shop your own company. Find out how easy you are to do business with through your own experience. Sure, you can hire a company to do surveys and do the mystery shopping for you, but learning through your own experience can be an eye-opening experience. Number 10, create a customer service culture, and it starts by setting an example and practicing what I call the employee golden rule, which is this, treat your employees the way you want the customer treated, maybe even better. By the way, Everybody should practice this when it comes to customer service. Everyone is a leader. And here's a bonus. I include this one in many of my lists, and I don't ever want you to forget to say thank you. I would be remiss if I did not remind you to show appreciation. You can thank a customer in person, on the phone, with a thank you note or an email. I think you get the idea. Now it's up to you. Choose one of these customer service strategies to start with. Have a meeting around it. Discuss how to implement it and then do it. Well, I hope you enjoyed this short lesson. Please be sure to visit my website, which is www.hyken.com. There you'll find more information about my speaking programs, as well as over 150 customer service articles that you can read and share with your colleagues. Thank you very much for watching. This is Shep Hyken. I'm reminding you to always be amazing.